It's match time. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith with you as always to describe it. And we're looking forward to something special today. Well, I think so, Martin. I hope these two teams won't disappoint us. Alan, give us the benefit of your insight on the home side. I think they've got to put away their disappointment, really, because they would have expected to be doing a bit better than this. They're fighting for promotion, but uh, with the squad they've got, I think they were fully expecting to be at the top of the table, but still time to recover. Well, the hosts come into this game with some very good statistics for their record here at home, and it is... Uh, Actually, unparalleled in the league at the moment. Oh, ten wins in 15 games. Superb. And Verona are going to line up for this game like this. 4-3-3. And they've got natural wide players in that front three with a central striker. I think that's the key, because those lads on the flanks... It's quite a complicated job, actually, because they've got a come inside, support the centre forward, and they've also got to funnel back when they haven't got the ball, so an onus on them. This is the away team lineup. We've got it down as a 4-3-3. Yeah, it's a system that the Netherlands used to use all the time. I think, really, they invented it, and uh, plenty of countries have adopted it since. If it works, it's, it's really uh, tough to handle. Guido Pantaloncini is our referee for this game. And it's the start of the game here. Bianchi. Throw in to come. Gomez. Mazzini. Well, this attack a bit of menace to it just working away to try and find an opening trying to thread it through here Pazzini they've got a corner now going to be a throw not a corner although some thought otherwise a lot of defenders between them and the goal but they still got the ball Luigi Giorgi Bianchi. They've got the ball back by that interception. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. They'll need to try and get the ball back now. Well, that's deflected behind. It will be a corner. It's a corner that's disappointing, really. The goalkeeper able to catch it without a challenge. But 
was good progress with this attack. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Luigi Giorgi. Bianchi. Into the attacking third. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. Brilliant team play this, with the passing, the movement off the ball to make the passing possible. The shot's on! On the front foot now, they've got a corner, hoping for the goal that would put them in the lead. Georgie! And that will be a throw. Gomez, Giampaolo Pazzini, good forward play from them, great passage of passing play there, saw the goal and went for it, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch, they're marking as tightly as they can, this corner could be a problem, they've got to defend it well. Pazzini, terrific stop. It's gone for a corner. And the added time will amount to three minutes at least. Attacking now. Building steadily here, keeping possession. And in goes the cross. It's a good place to win the ball here. So it's half-time and we're still waiting for that first goal. Well, sometimes managers say, just get us level at half-time and, and we'll, we'll sort it out in the second half of what we've seen in the first half. Is that this sort of game? It seems to be. 45 minutes still to go, second half underway. Romulo. Excellent passing, great interplay. Working hard just to see... Pazzini! That's great hands from the goalkeeper to make that kind of save. There's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team. Well, that's good support play from his teammates. Good place to win the ball back there because the pressure was starting to mount and the interception was timely to say the least. Doing well to keep the ball. Pazzini! Luigi Giorgi. There's some potential in this move. Cross coming in now. 
This is a good opportunity to put the ball into the penalty area now. And here's the shot. Another opportunity wasted by this team. It's still level in the match. Well, it's uh, one change, and it looks like it's a case of just trying to freshen the team up a bit. Got it back again from his teammate. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition. Now they're here. Probing away. Trying to find room for a shot, maybe. This with a chance to go into the lead now. And there it is, the goal. And it's put them into the lead. This is the team in form, isn't it? They are excellent, these players today, and they've got their reward here. When you look at all of them, they all fancy getting on the score sheet. They're all drifting forward. was the opening goal we've had to wait to the second half to get it but it's come now just a quick check on the clock and there are 20 minutes to go we've got the away manager indicating he wants to make a substitution now spotted well by the defender cut it out and here's the header and the goalkeeper can take charge now We're watching a very evenly contested game here. Neither side being able to dominate the ball. No, I mean, they've both got really good ball players, people that can keep hold of the football, and we have seen that today. Gomez. Now the countdown is to 10 minutes left. Good forward play from them. Got to be. Well, in a game where it will go down to the wire, that could have really been a turning point, but he's missed the chance. He's getting some stick as well off his own fans, and you can understand why. Trying to get the cross in, well blocked by the defender. noticeable that the home supporters are trying to help the team in this situation they're encouraged by the lead but they fearful perhaps that this team might lose it well they won't want to give anything silly away they? well the goalkeeper will hope that it stays like that throughout the game two minutes left that's added time Yankee clock running down as they try to run forward to get into goal-scoring positions now. And shoots! Easy work for the keeper here. 1-0 the final score as the referee brings an end to the game. It's been a rock of a defensive performance today. It has. They've come under an awful amount of pressure and you take a great deal of satisfaction from that as a defender. It's another home win on the record for the season. No, they didn't always have it their own way, but uh, got over the line in the end.